experiments that I read about recently was about plants and their future in medicine. What are your thoughts on that? About the future of medicine? No, 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 the future of medicine through growing plants in space, like how microgravity affects the plants and how that affects uh, health benefits. Oh, well, you know, it's, it's interesting. It's really nice to have a plant experiment on board. Not so much for the medical reasons, because you can grow plants for food as yeah. well, right? But to have a green growing thing, uh, it just makes it so much nicer. Because, of course, you know, the space station and the space shuttle and all of these vehicles we build for, in, to go into space, they're all metal and, and kind of stark, you know, kind of like living in a laboratory. And so to have some plants and some living, growing green things was psychologically very, very nice. Now, in the future, people are looking at, you know, what would it take to grow plants in space? Not, again, just for medical reasons, but for food reasons. Also, can you benefit from uh, an environmental and life support system uh, viewpoint? Because, of course, plants give off oxygen and they absorb carbon dioxide. You know, the real question is, how can you make that efficient? You know, what number of plants do you need? How much volume do you need? How much resources do you need to create a large garden? And then how useful would that garden be for food production and also for environmental life support? And of course, you know, any medicinal plants that you might want to grow as an added benefit. So just trying to understand how all of those variables stack up and is it an efficient way to approach um, or what is the most efficient way to approach, you know, growing plants in large scale in a, say, a lunar settlement or something like that.